Welcome to our Native Plants, Native People's Garden. This is a garden that doesn't get enough attention. Not too many people go off the beaten path and come down to this absolutely beautiful part of San Diego Botanic Garden. Few people realize that nine of our 37 acres are actually devoted to the native flora and fauna of San Diego County. And so I'm right here with Heteromilles arbutifolia. It's one of the most common plants in the chaparral system of uh, our zone. And this is Toyon. This is a great plant that draws in a lot of animals and birds. And speaking of animals, you know, my one of my uh, colleagues here at the garden, Eric, described a botanic garden as a zoo for plants. I think that's such a fantastic description. But few people understand that our botanic garden is also a home for a lot of native animals. Last night, I was putting up Christmas lights for our Garden of Lights and Botanic Wonderland that'll be coming up very shortly. And in the trees were three huge great horned owls that were just having a symphony of, of hoots back and forth. What a sound that was. We have native hawks. We have red-tailed hawks, red-shinned hawks, cooper hawks. We have barn owls. We have foxes, bobcats, skunks, raccoons possums, any number of lizards, and our own resident pack of coyotes. Sunday night when I closed, the coyotes were howling. It sounded like a wolf pack party. It was so cool. This December, you can come and visit the garden when usually only I and a few select people get to enjoy it, and that's at night. And so you come out for our Garden of Lights. Enjoy the garden at night. It is a different feel, and you just may see and any number of our resident animal populations too. So we hope to see you soon at the garden and especially if you come at night.